Hi. Let's learn about absorption costing. Absorption costing, sometimes called full costing, is a managerial accounting method for capturing all costs associated with manufacturing a particular product. Under generally accepted accounting principles, U.S. companies may use absorption costing for external reporting. Absorption costing includes anything that is a direct cost in producing a good in its cost base. In contrast to the variable costing method, every expense is allocated to manufactured products, whether or not they are sold by the end of the period. The components of absorption costing include both direct costs, such as raw materials and labor, and indirect costs, also known as overhead expenses. In absorption costing, both direct and indirect costs are included in the cost of a product. Absorption costing includes all manufacturing costs, both direct and indirect, in the cost of a product. Variable costing, on the other hand, only includes direct costs in the cost of a product and treats indirect costs as a period expense. Assets, such as inventory, remain on the entity's balance sheet at the end of the period with absorption costing. However, it can inflate a company's profitability during a given accounting period. It is also unfavorable when management is making internal incremental pricing decisions. In an example, company ABC makes widgets and assigns an additional $2 to each widget for fixed overhead costs under the absorption costing method. The absorption cost per unit is $7, and both cost of goods sold and ending inventory are calculated based on this amount. Absorption costing allocates fixed overhead costs across all units produced for the period, while variable costing adds all fixed overhead costs together and reports the expense as one line item separate from the cost of goods sold or still available for sale. The main advantage of absorption costing is that it complies with generally accepted accounting principles and more accurately tracks profit during an accounting period. The main disadvantage of absorption costing is that it can inflate a company's profitability during a given accounting period and is not helpful for analysis designed to improve operational and financial efficiency. Absorption costing is typically used in situations where a company wants to understand the full cost of producing a product, especially when reporting financial results to external stakeholders. Absorption costing is a method of costing that includes all manufacturing costs, both fixed and variable, in the cost of a product. It is also used to calculate the profit margin on each unit of product and to determine the selling price of the product. Here are three key takeaways. 1. Absorption costing differs from variable costing because it allocates fixed overhead costs to each unit of a product produced in the period. 2. This type of costing method means that more cost is included in the ending inventory, which is carried over into the next period as an asset on the balance sheet. 3. Because more expenses are included in ending inventory, expenses on the income statement are lower when using absorption costing. Hope this would help. Thanks for watching.